Are you a content creator looking for effects to bring your videos to a whole new level? Welcome to Production Crate. Production Crate is the resource for graphics, visual effects, music, and much more. On top of that, these assets are compatible with your editing software. Get your unlimited free effects today or premium effects for only $49 a year. Make it awesome. If you guys like that effect, make sure to hit that like button down below, subscribe if you're new, and as always, let's get started right after the intro. Okay guys, so as you can see right now, this is the setup. I'll show you guys some close-ups of what you actually need. You need your laptop, obviously. You need a bottle of whatever beverage you have, and you actually need to tape that onto the back of your laptop. Now, I want to mention that you have to actually be careful what you're actually using as tape, because this one is not gonna leave any like marks behind if you pull it off, because this tape, it's a little less stronger than duct tape, but this one just didn't work. This bottle is way too heavy to hold that amount of liquid with just this like it's not really that strong of a tape it is just really simple like you cannot really use anything heavy with this one so i actually had to use two strips of duct tape onto my laptop so if as you guys can see if i open up my laptop the bottle is just gonna stay nice in place and if you're standing from this angle you won't be seeing anything you won't see like the you know the cap of the bottle sticking out at the end so that's basically what you want to do and now we're going to proceed to actually you know doing the effect and getting the timing right so let's move on with the actual effect. All right, guys. So what you need for this effect is basically a good light source and a tripod. And then you want to basically first film yourself pouring the liquid out of the screen. So what you want to do is, for example, like put your tripod like right here. And then you want to just, for example, like mount it onto the actual tripod and then it's really simple what you're gonna do then is you're gonna take your bottle and you are going to point this out of the screen and when you're actually gonna pour you want this cap part to be out of the frame you want to actually go ahead and export that file from your camera onto your laptop so that's what i did so i just transferred this one through my sd card i just slide it in and i just opened and copied that file onto the desktop of my laptop and if i play it back as you can see i'm just pouring the liquid out of the screen obviously i had like a bucket or something to you know to catch it up and that's what you want to play back so then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your tripod and you're gonna just mount it on like that so so we're gonna see the same angle as we had from the intro so then you're gonna take a glass you're gonna take it and you're gonna set it like for example like that and what you need to do is you need to real simple just play back this video and you did it is just basically a matter of timing that's how simple it is so you're gonna play it back and right when I'm gonna come into the screen I'm gonna make sure that the lid of this bottle it's nice and firm so I don't spill everywhere. So that's how you're gonna do this. So you're gonna play it back. Right when I'm gonna screw off the top, I'm gonna pretend to fill it in. And you want to basically like synchronize that motion. So you just want to practice that a couple times with the lid on so it's not gonna spill everywhere. So let's pretend that the lid is off. You wanna also, for example, like lift it up, tilt it, and then just put it down. And then with the lid off, the beverage is gonna come out. And that's how you're gonna create this really, really clean look. You don't need to do anything special in post. What you can do is you can, for example, like mess a little bit with like with the brightness of your screen. I have to turn that down quite a bit because I right here I have a light source and if I would actually like turn up the brightness of my screen all the way it would actually look a little bit too bright as you can see for you guys and the beverage would like end up looking green just play around with the brightness of your screen and turn it down just a little bit and then it's just basically a matter of just practicing and practicing with the lid on and once you have the movement down pour it in and that's how Zach King does he just tapes a bottle or a tube of liquid onto the back of his laptop he screws off the top he practices it a couple times it's that simple there's nothing too much you know in post done and that's a really cool effect guys I have another Zach King 
cooking uh, technique or tutorial or trick, whatever it is, in mind, uh, which I'm gonna probably do later this week. I have to see what my schedule is. Guys, that's it. Thank you so much for watching, and it is really that simple. So guys, that's it for this video. It's a little bit more like stunt heavy, a little bit like VFX lighter, like the post-production takes a lot less time than actually just, you know, practicing it. So that's it. If you guys enjoyed this trick, make sure to hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new, if, if you want to see more of those uh, like Zack King tutorials. I have a lot more ideas coming this week or probably like next week. <coughs> <coughs> that's it and I'll see you guys obviously in my next one.